Let's learn how this amazing factory works. The male reproductive system begins with several sperm producing tubules inside the testes. These tubules connect to another tube called the epididymis where sperms are released and stored for some time. The epididymis is further connected to a long muscular tube called the sperm duct. During its journey through this duct, it activates the sperms to swim. The sperm ducts from two testes open into the urethra which eventually lets the sperm outside of the system. However, before the sperms exit the male reproductive system, they are mixed with some secretions from the three accessory glands, the seminal vesicles, the prostate gland and the cowper's gland. Secretions of seminal vesicles help in the transportation of sperms through semen and provide energy to them. Whereas the prostate gland secretes an alkaline fluid that neutralizes the acid found in the male urethra and the female reproductive tract. Further, the secretion of Cowper's gland lubricates the urethra for the smooth transfer of sperms. This mixture of sperms with the secretions from three glands form a milky white fluid called semen. This semen is ejaculated outside the male reproductive system via the urethra.